if we're close or not. That might be it. Oh, it is. It definitely is. They just sent out a flare. It did. They just sent out a flare. That definitely is them. Oh boy. Hello everyone and welcome back to Stormworks. Today we are back in survival, which is honestly kind of surprising because we have not been in survival for a long time. And I do have a reason for that. The main reason is that there survival can get boring over time, especially during the beginning. Uh, as for right now, mostly all you can do is missions, and those can kind of get boring over time. So I've wondered, what can I really do with uh, survival? I've modded the waves, and I'm wondering what I should really do to really make the survival experience fun. What makes the survival experience in Stormworks fun? I guess I guess that's my question. So I'm going to try and figure that out today. But before I get into all those details, let's go ahead and get back in my boat. Uh, and let's go uh, let's go save some people before we uh, we talk about the survival and its uh, implications. Okay, we're back in the boat here. Man, oh Oh, do we have damage? I, I don't think we do. Hopefully not. Uh, let's see here. I think our winch is damaged, but that that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and start this thing up here. Throw it in reverse. There we go. Okay. Now there's a few there's a few things you could do. One, we could go to the Arctic. I believe this thing at its maximum fuel capacity can travel to the Arctic. Uh, although that's probably, probably honest, like, honestly really inefficient. I do have my VTOL, though. Now that I have this hanger, I can get my VTOL. That could be a good idea. But I'm still questioning on whether or not that could actually, oh. Oh, that's what I could do. I could, I could get my VTOL. And then once I get my VTOL, I should be able, should, be able to conquer mostly everything. And I'll be able to transport, uh, cargo, which should be pretty good. However, I'm not fully sure how that's gonna go, but we'll, we'll just have to see about that one. Man, it is not nice out. Okay. Uh, we should be fine here. Survival is one of those things where I really just get to talk about Stormworks, and it's it's really interesting. And I hope you guys enjoy it as well. Uh, listen to me ramble on and uh, talk about Stormworks, and I hope you guys would like to join me in my talk down in the comment section down below, as I'll be responding to your comments and questions about Stormworks and stuff. This really is a time where I enjoy talking about Stormworks and engaging with you guys in the comment section about. Stormworks in general so if you like me doing these types of episodes in survival while I'm just playing survival uh, let me know this is definitely different than what I usually do but I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, yeah let's uh, let's go ahead and find the first mission okay got our first mission uh, took a while I ended up going on a different mission uh, and turns out I had to have a car for that, so I ended up running and wasting a lot of time. But now we're on the move again. We're going to rescue five casualties. So one of the first things I would want to talk about is... Oh, are you kidding me? Well, I'm not even there yet! Oh, boy. Okay. Well, um... I guess one of the first things I want to talk about is what are we going to do in the survival other than constantly going out and saving people. I know I want to get a VTOL. Uh, that's going to take some time though. I know that. It's probably going to cost over 50,000 credits or dollars or whatever this is. I think it's dollars. Yeah, okay, it's dollars. or may I don't know what it is. I'm just gonna call it dollars. Uh, so anyways, what are we gonna do? Because right now I have the waves modded to two or three times their normal size. 
And then I also have yeah, that's pretty much it. So, what should I do in in uh survival? Should I maybe I don't know. Let's see. What what can we do? We can do uh there's oil and then there's like um crate shipping. There's quite a few different things. Um it's all pretty interesting. Okay, we're starting to come up on a vehicle here. Oh boy. Oh, they're, they're like right here. Oh my goodness! What am I supposed to do? Oh, 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 never mind. It looked like a huge ship. I don't know if that was just me. But that thing looks huge. Okay, I need to drop this flashlight. Actually, no, I need to put it on the charger. Excuse me, put that flashlight there. Thank you, okay. Oh boy. All right, let's get these people out of the ocean. Uh, it says one has died. Who knows where? I have no idea where they could possibly be. Uh, it seems pretty deep, too. Okay, we got another one here. Follow me. Okay. Okay, this thing is definitely sinking. Uh... S sir, follow me. We're go we're getting out of here. Oh boy, these modded waves. They make the tiniest things like huge. Okay, get it on the boat. Get in that seat. You get here. One here. Uh there we go. And boom. That's that's all five. I'm I'm not sure what it meant by uh we've got a death. It looks like we got everyone. Wait, there's an interior. Hold on. Uh, let's check inside here. I think we're good. It definitely seems to be sinking, so uh, I don't think there's much I can do for that. But get out of here. Oh, what the? That thing just launched me. What in the world? Okay, we got everyone we need. Let's head out of here. Okay, that thing is, um, sinking. Uh, and we're gonna go to a hospital. I wonder if there's a hospital boat anywhere nearby. Probably not, because I don't have the latest game. Let's see, the closest hospital is all the way over here. At the light at Lighthouse OB. Okay. Let's set that. Set that as our waypoint. Okay. And we're on our way again. In general, it seems like Stormworks survival is mostly this. Going and picking someone up, and then traveling quite a while to drop them off. That's what the core gameplay of Stormworks survival seems to be. Which, granted, that is sort of what Coast Guarding is. You're, you go out to help people and you take them where they need to go. But... In terms of a game, I can see where it can be hard to make it into a game that's solely based on that. Which is probably the reason why most people don't really play the Stormworks single player that often. It really is interesting. It really it really is uh, like like a sort of special special idea of to, to really it really makes you think of how can it be done. And that leads me to think about, like, the weapons DLC and the implications of that and also how it's going to be in general. Because I feel like it's going to be something extremely fun. And the mode they're talking about, where we actually go and conquer the world, if they can pull that off successfully, that sounds like it will be amazing to play in Stormworks. If they can pull it off, though. That is the key thing here. If they can pull it off, it may be the best thing you can do in Stormworks. There's not really a good place to park here when you're trying to get to the stinking hospital. You just kind of got to stop and then, yeah, just beach it. Okay. Everyone up. One of the things I think about Stormworks 2 is... It really can... I, I feel like the devs are given sometimes a, a really hard time. Which, I mean, it's a team of four. And physics games are kind of tricky. 
All right, let's go ahead and take these people in. There we go. Casualty rescued. All right. There's one mission done. And let's go see what else we've got. Okay, we got our final mission here we're going to do today. If you guys are enjoying this so far and you're not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button to help me as a small channel grow. We recently hit 500 subscribers and we're already up to 540 something now and that's awesome and I thank you guys so much. Uh, we're really starting to grow now. We're definitely on the road to 1k and I really appreciate it. And with school going on and stuff, this stuff can definitely be hard to pump out. Especially with all the work I've got to do, but I hope you guys are enjoying it. I hope I, I, hope I can bring a smile to your day by making this and thank you guys so much for watching and if you really want to help support the channel you can check out my patreon or my merch either way it will help support the channel and if, if you don't have any money the best thing you can do is just watch and enjoy my videos that 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 is one of the best things you can do my goodness it is deep out here let's see it no, 200 meters and still getting deeper. My goodness. Okay, so that means if it gets windy, these waves are monstrous. Okay, good to know. Oh, 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 I think we got some over here. Definitely within the range. That definitely looks like it. Oh, boy, what in the world? Okay, we need to turn off the lights here. What do we have? Oh, it's a big one. It's a big... Wait. Maybe that... Is that it? I can't tell... If we're close or not. That might be it? Oh, it is! It definitely is. They just sent out a flare. It did. They just sent out a flare. That definitely is them. Oh, boy. Let's shut her down. We are within anchor range. Definitely not. 182 meters deep. Whoo, that is deep. Oh, that looks weird. Okay, let's get all the people. This thing is definitely experiencing issues. Oh, this would be perfect for a thumb. Oh, whoa. Whoa, no, 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 no. Don't get in the fire. Okay, um, we're going to have to find a fire extinguisher. Um,. Maybe there's something inside. Hopefully. Okay. Back back to where we are. Uh, I need a fire extinguisher. Where's the fire extinguisher? I got a welding torch. I can't even equip one even if I wanted to. Uh, I know there's someone up in front in said fire. Come on, come on, come on. Ugh. Okay. I got them. I don't know if they're alive, but I got them. Okay, um, I'm going to have to bring the boat closer. It is way too far. Okay, okay, okay. The worst thing that could happen is a Megalodon just comes up and just just starts biting. Okay, uh, you sit. They're full health! How are you full health? What in the world? Okay, okay, well, okay, okay, I figured this would happen. I have nothing to extinguish the fire. That means... In order to complete this mission, I must scuttle this boat. You know what? If it if it must be done, it must be done. Come on, let me up. Come on. There we go. Come on, everyone. We gotta get out of here. Wait, what the? I'm glitched. Oh, boy. Okay, follow me, sir. Uh, Jump over. Okay. I, I don't know how many casualties there are. I'm gonna have to check. Let's see. Five casualties, and I only have three. Three casualties. Okay, come on. Get in a seat. You, sir, get in a seat. Oh, boy, okay. I feel like it'll actually sink itself with the fire damage. I don't know. We'll have to see. Okay, okay, okay. We need to, uh, is there anyone inside? There has to be. Oh, jeez. We're taking damage. Taking a lot of damage. No. 
I don't think there's anyone else inside. Okay. Use my leftover health kit. I don't see anyone. Oh, there's one. Oh, whoa. Oh my goodness, the damage. Okay, I literally can't go in that fire anymore. Um, this isn't good. Uh, it's gonna sink. I think I got most of the people. Although I, I'm hurting. I am definitely hurting. Okay, um, oh boy. One, two, three, four. We got four. Uh, do I, okay, I do have a firefighting outfit and some health. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. I've got firefighting, fire, firefighting. I got firefighting outfit. Uh, is there, there's gotta be something somewhere. I can get up like normal person. There we go. Okay. Um, running, running through. I don't see anyone. I don't see anyone. The last person is probably down in the bay and I can't get down there no more. It's all on fire at this point. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Okay. Nope. Okay. We're gonna have to abandon this thing. There's no way. There's no way I can get down there. Okay. That stinks. That really does. Okay. We're getting out. I think it's about to explode actually. I just saw a big old puff go up. We need to go. We need to go before that goes. Come on. Come on. Come on. This is not good. Oh boy. That is not good. Um, I can't believe I have no, I, had, I don't have a fire extinguisher. Okay. That thing is definitely going to sink. We need to get to a hospital with our survivees if that's what you can call them te technically maybe okay there is a hospital here I'm gonna set waypoint start the engines okay is there a ladder no it's like there's nothing I guess it expects me to... The, oh, there it is. There they are. Okay, anchor deploy. Come on, everyone. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta get going. Y'all, y'all are hurting. There it is. The doctor's office. There we go. I got some rescues for y'all. There we go. Okay, we got four casualties we rescued. Uh, we didn't get the final one, but... We should be fine. But anyways, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and listening to me ramble on. This is definitely a different video. And if you're all the way to the end, I really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to help support me, uh, you can check out my Patreon. You get all kinds of benefits with that. Or you can check out my merch. And I will see you guys in the next one. God bless you. Today's Bible verse is 1 John 4 verse 16. We know how much God loves us, and we have put our trust in His love. God is love, and all who live in love live in God, and God lives in them. And thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. God bless you.